Hi, I'm Rick from AC Delco. Today we're going to walk through the process on how to register for TISTA Web or GMSI. So let's get started. If you notice at the address bar, I have www.acdelcotechconnect.com. That's the direction we're going to go. Once you arrive at the website, you'll notice on the left hand side that there are two options service information and TISTA Web. Either icon will bring you to the next screen. So click on the icon. AC Delco offers a cafeteria style menu. This way you can pick and choose the software that's right for your company's business needs. You can purchase software starting from two days, purchase it for three months, or even a one year subscription. Down at the bottom, subscribe to TIS now. If you typed in www.gmtechinfo.com, it would have taken you to the AC Delco TDS page that you're on right now. You may want to bookmark this page for future easy access to your purchased software. Note that in the help link in the upper right hand corner is where you will get contact information and frequently asked questions you may have. Since we do not have a login or a password, we need to register first. So click on Not Register User Link. Let's fill out the information. Everywhere there's an asterisk, you have to fill in the information appropriate. You'll have to confirm your email. Then you'll have to provide yourself a login name. In this case, I'll make it simple. The next field you're going to come to, note it doesn't have an asterisk. It's called the LSID. So if you have that, you would like to enter that now. If not, we'll continue down. So back at the address bar, put in your address appropriate to the credit card you plan on using. Select the city and then select the state. It's important that you enter the zip code because that's the first lookup as they're looking up the credit card information. Now that we're at the home phone number, this is a little unique. You note that there's four boxes. Feel free to put in the phone number that's applicable to your phone. Notice below that it says required fields with an asterisk. The information is just really relying on anything up above that has an asterisk as a required field. There should be nothing input on this line. Click Submit. One of the things you need to know is there's a back to welcome button. So click back to welcome. That takes you back to the TDS screen again. Note that if you need a password reset or you've been locked out, so if you lose it, the link is right here below. Now that we're back at the login screen, everything is case sensitive, including the IDs and passwords and security questions. If the password expires, the message will say password invalid. Now that we've established a login and a password, enter that information now. The next screen that comes up is terms and conditions. After reviewing the information, as you're scrolling down, at the very, very bottom of this pop-up window, If you agree to the terms and conditions, click or click the radio button, accept, and then click continue. Now that you've registered, you're ready for the next step, how to subscribe to GMSI and TISTA Web. This is Rick from AC Delgo. Thanks for viewing this clip.